There's an ancient place very few know about, the land stretching east and across the Great Dividing Range. It's home to rare wildlife and the incredible source of all our drinking water. This place is sacred to our first people and a rare jewel to all Victorians. Ancient forests, marvelous beasts that are the world's tallest flowering trees. These forests literally feed our water, invigorating the great city of Melbourne. And within these flowing rivers, there's unique life and connection. As the ferns open up, there's landscapes sweeping as far as the eye can see this extraordinary country we call home. The patchwork of forests, watercourses of volcanic outcrops created over 350 million years. Journey on horseback, cross country on foot, climb the sheer and rocky escarpments, paddle the many tributaries and negotiate the very heart of the forest watery channels. And as you cross the weathered soil, you're sure to witness beauty and now devastation in equal measure. Our central highlands forests are collapsing from logging and fires. The mighty trees and truly unique wildlife going extinct. Logging these native forests for cheap paper at an intangible cost to all Victorians because it operates at a loss, a loss. With only 1% of the old growth forests left and climate change taking its toll, we have to stop logging have to preserve the very source of our precious water, because once they're gone, they're gone. These forests store more carbon per hectare than any other forest on the planet and are the ecological cradle of Victoria. The trees harness our drinking water, supply our farms, our food. We need them standing. They're worth immeasurably more standing than lying down. We are the trees, the creatures, the places and people that make up what could be Victoria's Great Forest National Park. Come on, Melbourne, let's make it happen. <laughs>